welcome to the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim, Road to Platinum. Um, we are going to clear the fort of whatever. Never should have come here. Oh.
touch it. Okay. Um. Let's just go here and, and clear it out, maybe.
exist, right? What? Like, Fendal isn't even here. Fendal? because of the spiders, but yeah. Thanks for saving my ass. What's the hurry? I don't know. Why do you ask? Like, I don't know. Maybe I'm struggling so much in this difficulty because I'm playing as a mage, which is something I also never did. Up to the blue palace Alfred gets his hand on that crown see. it won't Even be a fairy tale welcome back soldier i'm glad you made it in one piece i'll send men to garrison the fort right away you did well i'm impressed but before we go any further it's time for you to officially join the legion 
Speak with General Tullius. He'll administer the oath. Okay. In joining the Legion, you'll be taking an oath binding you what the rebels to the service like to of the Emperor is that the Empire and thus to every citizen of, of the Empire. Changed your mind? Decided you wanted to soldier for the Empire after all. Well then, repeat after me. I didn't you know. Upon my honor, I do swear undying loyalty to the Emperor, Titus oh. Mead II. And unwavering obedience to the officers of his great empire. Mm -hmm. May those above judge me, and those below take me, if I fail in my duty. Mm -hmm. Long live the Emperor, long live the Empire. Empire! Welcome to the Imperial Legion, soldier. Just remember, we take care of our own. Once you're in the Legion, you're in it for life. Sure. Speak to Behrend. He's normally out by the forge. He'll get you outfitted. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Legate Ricca has a special assignment for you. All right. Tell me again why I'm wasting men chasing after a fairy tale. If Ulfric gets his Stay hand sharp. on that crown, it won't be a fairy tale. It'll be a problem. Don't you Nords put any stock in your own traditions? Welcome to the Legion, Auxiliary. I thought the Moot chose Listen the king. Up. We're backing Elisif. When the Moot meets, they'll do the sensible thing. Dude. Welcome to the Legion, Auxiliary. Listen up. Ulfric's right-hand man, Galmar Stonefist, has located what he believes is the final resting place of the Jagged Crown. Mm -hmm. We're going to make sure he doesn't get his hands on it. Okay. The rest of my men are already assembling outside Corvinjun. I'll meet you there as soon as I finish up here. Okay. Not everyone's agreed to the moot. You've been here long enough to know that Nords aren't all- Okay. What? Okay, guys, so, excuse me for eating. Um, we, um, We how we now have a trophy called taking sides, which is basically you either align yourself with the stormcloaks or you align yourself with the imperials. Um, and that ensure and getting that trophy before proceeding with the main quest will just ensure that there, um, there's a specific trophy that is not missable. I forget the name of it though. But yeah. My goodness, why are you so unathletic? Thank you. Fucking gorgeous. Oh, what is this person? Why do you have two helmets?
Oh. Nothing held back. To be fair... Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. Really? Where? Interesting. Same dragon. Damn it. We're blundering around in the dark here. We need to figure out who's behind it all. I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were Dragon Slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest Dragon Slayer. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. The faction that rules the Aldmeri Dominion, the ones who almost destroyed the Empire during the Great War 30 years back. There's no worse enemy to humankind in Tamriel. The Empire barely survived the last war. The Thalmor don't intend to lose the next one. The oh, first thing we to need you. to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. Nothing solid, yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy... It's oh, the is this the one where we go Skyrim. undercover? Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a yeah, miser's I think purse. So. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. Hmm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. Okay. Alright, let's go there. Hello. I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor Embassy. That would be a bad idea. I'd be too likely to attract the wrong kind of attention. But they don't know you at all yet. The Thalmor ambassador, Elenwen, regularly throws parties where the rich and connected cozy up to the Thalmor. I can get you into one of those parties. Once you're inside the embassy, you can get away and find Elenwen's secret files. I have a contact inside the embassy. He's not up for this kind of high-risk mission, but he can help you. His name is Malborn. Wood Elf. Plenty of reason to hate the Thalmor. You can trust him. I'll get word for him to meet you in solitude at the Winking Skeever. You know it? 
While you're doing that, I'll work on getting you an invitation to Ellen Wynn's little party. Meet me at the Solitude Stables after you've arranged things with Melbourne. Any questions? Sounds good. Be careful. Okay. Hello, Marlboro. Good afternoon. Really? You're who she picked? I hope she knows what she's doing. Okay. Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy for you. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. The Thalmor takes security very seriously. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. Okay. Okay, I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've got to go. I'll find you at the party. Don't worry. I'm naked. I'm... Why am I naked? to buy clothes, man. I don't want to walk around like that. Your job is to get into the party without being fingered as a spy. I'll take care of the rest. Okay. All right, people. We are no longer Have naked. You heard? There's been another dragon attack. Kinds grow. Fuck yeah. Fashion. All right. Where we have to go? Oh, Ooh, at the stables. Let's do it. Where is the... Oh. Hi! Have you given Melbourne the gear you want to smuggle into the embassy? Yep. Good. I have your invitation to the party. But the only way you're going to get past the guards is if they really believe you're an invited guest. Which means you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Here. Put this on. When you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. Really? You'll only have what Melbourne smuggled in for you, plus whatever you can pick up inside. You can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dressed like that. Okay, okay. You can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dressed like Why? Is it my hood? I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Ready to board the carriage to the embassy? Uh, yeah. Don't worry, it will all be waiting for you when you get back. Just make sure you get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. My mohawk. That is a mohawk, right? Fellow latecomer to Ellen Wynn's little soiree. Hello. And arriving by carriage, no less. I salute you, my good lady. Thank you. My lateness is due more to getting lost on the way up this God's forsaken mountain than to any desire to actually arrive late. I prefer to arrive early, often the day before the party, so as not to miss out on any of the drinking. All right. Oh man, I'm There's alone. Not drinking God damn it. Today. Alright guys, time to end the episode. Thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you soon.